All right, so do a tonic, intermediate, and we'll go with main. Dude, this guy behind me is lighting me up. Ugh, I get this garbage weapon. This weapon sucks. Oh yeah, good weapon. Boost time. I got hit with it. <laughs> One second? What the heck? You can actually fall there and die. <laughs> Let's go. All right, we'll screw it up this time. I don't remember which way is faster. Probably the other way.
Oh my god. Get those little crappy pitter patter shots out of here. These are the same. Yeah, I saw that coming. Oh my god, and then the tornado? I think I only need 8th place to qualify. Yeah, this, this bike's shield is garbage. But the speed is good. Sucker put me at zero. <laughs> That's freaking brutal. And I'm back to no shield. I'm not exactly sure what the significance of shield is. I think as your shield goes down, you slow down more when you get a hit, but I'm not 100% sure. Gotta back off, dudes. Alright, let's go. Let's try this again. Damn, that guy's really far ahead. Ah, crap. 
it's going to be tight even getting second. Oh. Get wrecked, me. Dude pwned us. Final race. That's what happens when you play the easy one. I can't believe this game is going to be so short. It sucks. I'll probably just play more. I don't know if I really feel like starting a new game. Jesus. Where did that even come from? The weapons all seem to be on this side. As I say that. Yeah, there we go. The good stuff. No. Back off. Oh my god. Alright, well that that was a thing. Cool. That's what happens when you go too fast on this level. I've had no shield for a full lap. <laughs> this is freaking brutal. Because I had no shield, I also had no freaking laser. That was also brutal. Dude. These guys are ruthless. So, yeah, we beat Atomic, we have a critical mass. Oh, oh, it's defaulting to intermediate. Oh, it's because I picked intermediate the last time. I mean, I guess we'll try it. Um, did I get a new car? Constantly. The weapons suck though. Right, 
Is that new? Polly on new? Where are you? Polly on loses some acceleration, gains some speed, loses some turn, gains some shield. Yeah, I think I gotta stick with main. Oh, he went in between the boosts? I didn't know you could do that. Oh, this weapon sucks. I just like totally nuke this guy's boost. It's rough. Oh, I'm out. I'm out of laser. Pretty good weapon to have in first. The double, the double boost. I thought I could like drop my weapon. They let you do that in Extreme G2, I think. I think you can drop your weapon if you don't like it. Oh, into the wall. That was a lot of boosting. Comfortable lead now. <laughs> Easy. Yeah, getting a good start is kind of nice. Literally can't get off that wall if I get that booth. Straight shot all the way back. No one. Also, yo, what the hell? I was in second? Excuse me? So 
we'll try going this way. Maybe this way's better. Alright. Yeah, what how are they so close to them? There we go. You have to make that turn really early. Dude, what a freaking legend. See that shot I hit? Alright, new stage. You guys haven't seen this one yet. Crap. No. No. Yo, ham! Man, that's really loud in my ears. But it's not loud for you guys, so that's good. Ham, good to see you, dude. It has been a long time. How have you been? Actually, my plan. I wanted to hit him, so he fell behind, and then hit the other guy. Oh, you get your weapons back each lap. Okay. But then I remember. God, this freaking garbage weapon. You're tired? Here, I'm actually pretty tired right now. I didn't sleep a ton last night. Man, I'm getting rocked. I don't know the good places to use Pierce either. Like here, I, like wow, that would be a good spot because it's straight. timing on that. Ah, still third? Well, that guy was in third. Ah, uh, first and second are so far away.
How's, uh, how's life been without Smash, Han? Oh, the move sucked. The move always sucked. The move's never good. You're working for an ambulance company? That's interesting. What do you do for the ambulance company? The trick to using these lasers is definitely hitting people and then not running into them after they slow down. It's tough. To get the hell away. You mostly play on your Switch now. Oh, you play? Do you play Ultimate, or you just play other games on your Switch? medic services are you a, are you an EMT are you a medic I didn't, I didn't if you were I didn't I didn't know that Alright, dodge that. And start versus. Really in first. Oh, I did. Oh, they must have gone the other way and got hit by the tornado. Hell yeah. Let's go. Oh, you are an EMT. Nice. And yeah, Ultimate does suck online. I agree. I mean, it's like playing 64 online. It's just not... Not fun. Unless you're, like, just messing around with friends. Get some new weapons in here. There's a weapon that it always felt like it should make you go faster, but I don't think it does. Ooh, I just dodged it. I haven't played Ultimate in a really long time. There were like, there was like a few weeks, like last winter, where I, I would occasionally play uh, on this guy's stream, like a few matches. That was it. 
uh, I've played the game for probably like a, you know, after unlocking all the characters and the game first came out, I've probably played the game for like a few hours total. Glad my, my ultimate main got added to Remix. Bowser is awesome. Great lap. This track can be a little tricky. Um, let's just park. Oh, no. We have to like weave in between a bunch of buildings. And it's actually like, really sharp turns. Like this. Actually, it's not so bad. I made it up. No! Garbage weapon. I can't even like use it here because I'll probably hit myself. Alright, maybe. Splatoon 2? Yeah, probably not going to I I believe you that it's great and everything, but it's just... I know that's a game I'm not going to play. Played a bunch of the first Splatoon uh, during Snowso when Isaiah brought it. That was pretty fun. I had fun. But I can't, I can't see myself like sitting at home playing that game. No, now if I want to like play an online game, like I play WoW, like new expansions coming out soon. Um, if I want to play some fighting games, I'll log on to Fightcade and play a couple games of like, you know, Super Turbo or Third Strike or Marvelous Capcom, and then that's it. Ah, uh, well, I guess I don't need that one. Pew, pew, pew. So I guess the shield stat just means that your shield depletes at a slower rate when you get hit. That's probably it. There's a trick to playing this game. Yeah, you can like ride the walls to to gain speed, but I'm not, I don't know how to do it properly, so I'm not attempting it. Have I played Fall Guys or Among Us? Um, I have not played Fall Guys because I don't want to pay $20 for that game. Um, that I know I'm just not going to play it that much. That's the problem. Um, I did download Among Us and I played a few rounds. You know, the game's fine. It's chill. I, I like I like what it is. It's like, oh, I need a game I can just like throw on with some friends and like everyone can hop in voice and have a good time. Like, that's a good game. Fall Guys, like. Legit looks like a game that I would have fun playing, and I feel like I would be good at it. But I just know that I'm not going to spend that much time playing it. Go. No, you got me. 
Oh, I still got my boost. I still got some of it. Okay, did this say it was the last race? Oh, that was a new weapon. Thank you. Easy. Yeah, it's like I've gotten like one, literally one new game in the last several years that. I actually like played a bunch and it was uh, the messenger because I just know like I, I have all these N64 games I need to play and I just know like I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on a new game oh we're not even at the end there's so many courses Oh, all right. It's the shield. Get wrecked. This game's great. This is easily one of the best racing games on the console, and not that many people know about it, despite it getting a sequel. Dude, those. This, these hallways suck because those little like girders, or those like archways, um, are not. They actually stick out from the wall a little bit. So if you run into them, it'll stop you. Oh no, I wanted that. Okay, was this Extreme D2? Reversed, reversed missile. Correct, idiots. Oh, uh, you started playing Pokemon. Oh, Pokemon Coliseum, Mega Man, Mario Party Seven. Which um, which Mega Man? I do love me some Mega Man. But really, only once it got to Super Nintendo. I respect the originals on the NES for what they are, but I don't enjoy playing them. Yeah, this, this place can suck if you hit one of those arches. Oh, I could have gone that way to get the... So there's an item in this game. Uh, it's a two-part item. You drop one piece, and then you drop the second piece. And it's a teleporter. Um, if a car runs into that second piece you drop, it teleports you to the first piece. It's hilarious. Oh, I just got it, too. All right. So you drop one, and then you just wait as long as possible. So someone hits that second one, they go back to the first one. Pretty funny. Yeah, like the like the weapons in this game, they're not they're not like broken. They're good, but they they're not game breaking. I mean, obviously, like a well timed shot with a weapon is still really good. 
but the weapons in general aren't like just game breaking. Like Mario Kart or Snowboard Kids. I have two freaking boosts. Oh my god. Let's go this way. What am I even doing? Alright, so this is mine. Still don't think I should hit it. Easy. The transfer item? Oh, it's so good. Network transmission. The GameCube. I actually I have that. I've never played it, but I have it. Um what the guy that moved out of this house, um, right before I you know, right as I moved back in, he had like a box of games and he was like, ah, I'm never gonna play these. He's like I could just give them away or I can give them to you. He's like, I'll just leave them here. And on network transmission was one of them. Yeah, if this channel picks back up again and I can like do some real, you know, like sub goals and things like that, I'll, I'll probably have one for like a, uh, a GameCube night to play some GameCube games. I also found out I have uh, this Fire Emblem game for GameCube that's worth a lot of money. It's worth like $160, $200. So that was kind of cool. Oh no, it's gonna come this way. Wait, what's this thing? Oh, it turns me invisible. Yeah, yeah it's probably. I, I might even have two copies, Josh. All the GameCube games? Yeah, I have a bunch of GameCube games. probably one of those things like you lived here you you brought all the GameCube games from like growing up and then they just stayed here I have like I have multiple copies of each Metroid Prime because like I've just gotten them from like random things on Craigslist uh, I think I might have three copies of Melee All the all the game like all the non sixty four stuff is just in like several different boxes. So I need to like go through and organize everything. And now that I'm actually now that I'm in the basement here, I have a ton of space, so I might um, set up. I might get another TV and set up um, DDR down here. So I have PS two. That could be fun. Probably won't, I won't stream that or anything, but it'd be fun to play. I miss DDR. I know CTG will be happy. Am I willing to give away a copy of Metroid Prime 2? You're talking to the guy that just lost a lot of money. I'm not feeling especially charitable. <laughs> uh, so maybe someday. GameCube games are whatever though, because you can like emulate them pretty well, right? I guess you'd still need, like, an adapter to play them, you know, comfortably. I don't know, maybe you prefer using a different controller. Oh, it's over. I didn't, I didn't use a single, uh, boost. Path of Radiance is probably just didn't get, have that many copies released. I don't know what year it came out either. You don't know how to, you don't know how to emulate. You just, uh, you know, dolphin. Google, go to YouTube, and you type GameCube Emulator Tutorial, and then you watch some videos. That's what I do. Downloaded, like, RetroArch, and I was like, oh my god, what the hell is this program? Go to YouTube. Tutorial. Guy walked me through everything. What's my prize? Try entering name as Fisheye. No. 
it just uh, puts a fisheye lens. It makes the whole game fisheye. All right, meltdown. Here we go. Uh, I still got main. Our main man. That got pretty easy. I guess I just had to like get warmed up. This first one is just intense where it's like you need to get second or better. It's very daunting. But then after that, you know, you win a couple and then it's like you need eight. So yeah, each um, each circuit. I don't think the circuit. I don't think the AI gets harder with each circuit. Um, it's just longer, so you have more tracks. So I don't know how long that circuit just took us, but this one's going to be even longer. But there's some pretty cool levels. I like the very last one in the circuit. It's kind of cool. It's like especially futuristic. You're like, feels like you're on like an alien planet and stuff. It's cool. Maybe I like it just because it looks different than all the other tracks. There's like green grass and fields and stuff. Which is not what all the other ones are. Every other track is like mountain, desert, industrial complex. Like, you're in a city or something. There's no like open fields. Not much green. Yeah, Josh, Matt just, Matt just gave me all this stuff. Uh, there's a Wii in there and Prime 3 and a bunch of GameCube games. So there were a bunch of games in this box, and there were a bunch of, like, and I opened some of them, and they're just empty. There's cases. Like, all these Genesis cases that he had, they're just empty. Like, why? Why do you have these? It's actually kind of nice. I was going through like all the crap I have, and I had all these old like third-party um, cables, like power and AV cables for like Nintendo and, and Sega and stuff. And so I just put them up on uh, Facebook Marketplace, and some someone wanted them. It was great. And then when he got here, he like he's like, "Do you have any other video game stuff?" And I was like, "Do I?" And like sold him a bunch of other stuff. It was great. Oh, come back. No, oh, got me. How do they get so far ahead? What 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 turn am I taking wrong? They took this path last time, so we know this path is fine. Um, Alright, that's the other way. And then I get like what do we do that? 
Turtles. No. Crap. Alright, good. I actually wanted that weapon. Go away. Oh, they're nowhere near me. Damn it. Yo, come here. What's up, man? It's funny. I like sold all the stuff, and I'm I'm not sure if I actually have like a good GameCube controller. Mike owes me one though, so when he gets one in, I'll go steal it. Like one of the uh, the prize I won for winning video game trivia night at MAP was a uh, a Switch controller, like the Switch GameCube style controller, but it's USB, so it only works on the Switch. Like it doesn't work on GameCube. And I'm like, ah, I'm literally never gonna use this. Nice, got him. A shot. It's a quick course. Video game trivia is fun. Also, uh, if you guys are interested, I think the next one's in like two weeks, uh, and you can participate online on Twitch. Um, hopefully, you don't just Google stuff. But we had one person uh, in chat last time that was definitely googling things uh, because they got they like got some pretty obscure ones right, but then they got like one or two wrong, and. If you Googled the question, the answer they put was the first thing that came up, but it was wrong. I don't know, it was funny. We got to call them out. So I beat Google. Are you so close to me? Get out of here. I have two boosts. Oh my god. Yeah, it's crazy. Neon, the like OP car, turns sh so sharply that you like don't even need to use the uh, like the sharp turn button. You can just turn normally. You have one in the box. He bought a G3, a GameCube controller or a Switch controller. Got to be a GameCube controller. Switch didn't exist. <laughs> G3. <laughs> That's cool though. Yeah, I might have one. I might have a controller in like my controller drawer here, but I don't think it's a good one. I think it's probably a bad one. Back off, nerds. Zap. Oh, 
Oh, I really missed that. Needed that shield. No. Stop boosting. Yeah, the laser really is just it's so good. This guy's stealing my shields. I'll go, I'll go left. Oh, get wrecked, idiot. Nice. No. Oh, there's only a second line. Where? Yeah, it's only. Oh, it's only one. One missile. Yeah, that's that's sweet, man. Brand new uh, GameCube controller. Like, I don't play much GameCube, but I know at some point I'll go back and play a bunch of the games and it'd be nice to have a good controller. Either that or I can use my GameCube to, or my 64 to GameCube adapter. Oh yeah, I had another boost. So this definitely makes you go faster. Oh my goodness. Calm down, everybody. Everyone's going crazy. Yep, and I have no shield. No. That was just just a brutal lap. No, and I missed the shield. Yes. Finally. Good God. This is just not my race. 
Oh, homie. This guy's at three of them. Oh, I just keep stealing them. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, I doubt this was your roughest one. I, I actually I know exactly what the roughest one is. We'll we'll get to it. It was the one where you could fall off the edges into like lava. But that one is tough. The one I just played. I gotta choose between homing missile and boost. Definitely boost. I mean, it's always like a freaking junkyard. Everything's so industrial. Oh. Oh, my God, triple hunting. I don't even remember this song. I thought maybe I could just hit both of us with it. going up this time. Oh, and it's this trash weapon. Come on. What are you doing? We got the boost coming up. Double boost. Always the move. RIP my shield. What a lap. What a lap.
Okay, this is the last stage in Atomic. And we legit might only be halfway through Meltdown right now. I think it's a magnet. It might like pull people to me. I'm not sure that I could just easily be imagining that. Oh my god, I'm stuck. I was just stuck in the wall. Charles, it's also it's very lucky that these uh, were t two games that I ended up like having to go back to finish because they're games that I've played a ton, so I don't have to like you know really relearn any mechanics or get used to the game. As opposed to like if I had to go back and play like I don't know freaking Top Gear Rally. What? The oh, lights just turn off. What the heck. That's unacceptable. Well, I seem to turn the hell back on. Okay, we're just going through walls. What the hell, lights? Messed up. Power strip might not be the best. I'm ahead by like a mile, so I'm kind of tempted to just throw this race. So that I can fix these lights. Ah, see? That's what I was talking about earlier. close enough. Oh, the shield doesn't work on that. I want to test it. Sad.
<laughs> oh, I didn't know it was one of these hallways. Get away. All right, I think we're safe. Say that. All right, teleport. Oh, it's this level, man. This is the one. This is the one. Dude. Oh, he's like, too close to me. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. It's pushing me. Alright, push me out. Dude, I can't move. Oh my god. What is happening? Actually, Lightning Bolt's a really good weapon on this level. Alright, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna take an 8th place finish here. See if I can figure out these lights. Yeah, <laughs> you saw it load.
Hers is so far. So weird. I don't know what the deal is. Probably should replace this power strip anyway. This thing is gross. Oh, yeah. This stage, this stage is hard, especially when you're when you're playing as Neon, like the super fast car. You you can't just like hold accelerate. Like you really have to like take it easy. It also helps to be familiar with the level and remember all the turns and everything. This level just forces you to play so much better. Oh yeah, I mean, it doesn't matter, I can't win this race. Oh, I have to actually finish. Oh, that's so annoying. Just, like, let me auto-lose when the person in seven finishes, come on. Actually making me do this whole race. Oh, sweet. Oh, that hit me. Come on. gonna be one of those levels. Right, I'm the one with all the misses. Yeah, we played this one.
I don't want to get teleported. I'll take this. It's like being in first with three red shells. It's just nice. Done with the tornadoes. Oh, he's got him too. Oh yeah, let's go! <laughs> uh, Mario Kart 8, Mario Kart, Mario Kart, Mario Kart 8, they make you uh, finish. Oh, we have not played this stage yet. Man, it's been a long time. This stage is pretty cool. I think it's a, a new track, like music track. I don't think I've heard this one. Also, let's get wrecked. That nice straightaway. I can always forget it splits there. Damn, you're like one of the only people I've, I've met that has also played this game. Alright, this is the shield. So if I get near people again, I'll use it. How did I just get so far in first? What just happened? People just didn't, it just wasn't a popular game. I mean, it's, like, it's an early game, you know, game number 24, pretty early on in the lifespan, but I guess 
It just wasn't popular. Final race! Yes, I like this track. Yeah, yeah, it's like flying saucers and stuff. The alien home world. Oh man, it's like all the way on the side. No one's gonna hit that. There's like little birds flying and stuff. I guess the track isn't that special. Like the track itself. But the environment, everything's cool. The track itself is really simple. He says as he runs into the woods. Oh, yes. All this homing. We'll go for the double boost on the third map. Also, who who decided back in the day? Who decided that racing games were three laps? When did that become the standard? Because you know, uh, Super Mario Kart was four laps. I missed it, no. We don't get the double boost. No, the stupid wall again. Touchdown, easy, Darren Sharp. Pretty sure that's it. We unlock Neon. Oh, it's a roach. You get roach. If you beat it on extreme, that's what it is. You beat it on extreme, you unlock neon. That's what it is. 